cost involved in that generally is the fuel. Um, now most fuel cards that you have don't offer any financial benefits to having them, but mainly they'll give you um, security, i.e. staff aren't carrying cash around, um, they'll offer you convenience, um, you know, staff don't have to put in expense forms, as a good audit trail, um, and also security as well. Um, don't forget the less obvious costs as well, um, in terms of staff time coming out, the cost of driving the minibus to and from the station. Um, so if you have got a number of minibuses, it's well worth considering putting a tank on site if you've got the space to do it. I know a few people seem to think that's quite an expensive thing to do, but we've done a project recently for a school where actually they were much better off having a tank on site than they were um, even having a fuel card. The other thing to think about is um, with some cards, Shell CRT cards or BP Bunker cards for example, you can get a discount on your fuel price, on the pump price, um, by using those cards, but you can only use them in certain um, stations, so things like what they're called bunker stations. So it's worth looking into if you've got a fleet of minibuses and you want to save some money on your fuel costs. Um, that's it for this week, um, until next time, soldier on!